Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Your accountant should provide you with the amounts to enter for depreciation on your fixed assets. They should at least double check your own calculations for depreciation entries. When you have these amounts, you can enter them into the decrease column of the accumulated depreciation subaccounts register that you have created for the selected fixed asset. The amount will then be attributed to an expense account like depreciation expense. Note that the accumulated depreciation subaccount will always have a negative balance as its purpose is to track the loss of value to the fixed asset which is its parent account. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.